Ski Mom here. They have the soft opening of the big chairs today up here at Mount Bachelor, so I'm gonna go check it out. Uphill skiing is my favorite thing to do, and I like to share this information with you. here came up to check it out so they've got the red chair running today as you can see but um, the snow level is still pretty low it's really festive up here so I think I'm gonna hike and uh, get a little bit of hiking in because the red chair is running that means that the leeway path for hiking is open When one hikes in the resort, it is referred to as side country. Since I began learning in 2009, Mount Bachelor has been an easy and safe place for a beginner skier like me to gain knowledge and confidence. With the boom in interest, my home mountain, lovingly referred to as Batchy, has made accessibility to safe uphill routes easy for its guests. that's at the base of the red chair and it looks like actually the pine route is not open because the red chair doesn't go all the way up so because there could be machinery there working they keep it closed so that nobody will get injured and everyone will stay safe so you can check this on the Mount Bachelor website or when you get here you can check it out but as you can see the cone is always open 24 hours a day and then the Pine Martin Lodge route is open if Pine Martin chair is running, typically. And the Summit route is open if the Summit chair is, is running. And that goes up to uh, along the West Ridge. But do check the website because it can depend on day to day. Skis are believed to have been used as a mode of transport as far back as 6000 BC. Skis have been found in bogs in the Altai Mountains. That's the top of the world, bordering Mongolia, Northwest China, and Southern Russia. You can see these uphill route signs are not always visible. So you want to be sure that you can see them when you're hiking up and be looking for them because if you can't see the signs, then the people skiing down cannot see you. of the signs that is what keeps you safe from the people who are skiing downhill so always do the best you can to stay to the skiers right of the designated signs Obey the signs. Yep. Obey the policy. So right. and check. obey the closures and open sign for your safety. Yeah. Because yeah. they're like could be working on the mountain to make it great for us. Yeah. Yeah, so it's to keep you safe. And say hi to Alex. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> that was only two, Yes, folks. 
skiing appearing to have its archaeological beginnings at the top of the world. We're really lucky to have an uphill policy here at Mount Bachelor. It does a couple things. It keeps us safe. It um, gives us a place to practice and it increases our community. So if you are interested in uphill skiing, you've never done it before, go to one of the many shops in town, Mountain Supply, Pine Mountain Sports, that offers uh, uphill gear, demo a setup and come up here and give it a shot to see if you like it. And for sure, if you're new to backcountry skiing, come up here and practice, practice, practice with your gear before you get out in the backcountry. That way, when you make mistakes and learn new things, you're safer. So thank you, Mount Bachelor. And be sure to say thank you to the ski patrollers and to Mount Bachelor and check the website for openings. Woo! on skis was a vital part of life from the Norwegian coast to the Bering Sea. They used them in muddy bogs to cross the water and not sink in. You can see how that would be beneficial. So I'm glad I came up. I got some exercise. I got to assess the conditions and make sure I have all my gear ready to go. I'm not going to do the cone today. I just think there's not enough snow yet. I'm just gonna ski down the run with these beautiful people. Yes, my ski peeps, all of this cool data proves that I, Ski Mom, without a doubt, am a noob, a newbie to the sport. What I do know is that in the past 20 years, human technical advances have made uphill skiing accessible to all alpine skiers and even snowboarders. In the not-so-distant past, one had to be a proficient Nordic skier performing tele-turns, not an easy craft to perfect, to be able to access the mountains through hiking on skis. In the past 10 years, a boom has occurred, and uphill skiing and boarding has exploded. Please comment below if you have any theories as to why we are so blessed with the explosion of this lovely activity. <music> Mount Bachelor has been an easy and safe place for a beginner skier like me to gain knowledge and confidence. With the boom in interest, my home mountain has made accessibility to safe uphill routes easy for its guests. Here I arrived from the foggy drive through town and it is sunny and beautiful up here. They got the red chair running. It's the first day of the red chair and I might hike. Into the fog we go, back into the fog. It was an inversion today. Town is in the fog and the mountains are in the sun. Always check the report. Unless it's going to stop you from going. 